up you guys so to keep you guys updated uh the sweet corn that i'm growing um it's a small variety but uh, i feel so bad for these plants but you guys can see they're growing very tall and very wise and a soybean but we're getting some soybean pots that's early but at the moment i'm building like a it's it's a wired fence it's like chicken wire but a little bit smaller holes now because i know so what i'm doing this should be not so hard you think that's a it is no it isn't it's a leaf and um potentially what i'm doing because i lost a lot of corn and stuff in here is i'm actually gonna go ahead and um put a wire over this so this is kind of like chicken wire and uh rabbits and stuff go underneath and um small little critters go through them and they actually get to my corn so the best way to do this besides spraying chemicals so far it's organic has been set for the liquid the solid fertilizer i put early stage but at the moment i haven't put anything on just water uh, with the sprinkler but i gotta protect the plants so the one way i'm gonna do that is by putting a screen around the fence so wish me good luck all right so to kind of demonstrate what i'm gonna do i'm taking this wire fence and stuff as you guys can see and i'm actually i can get this of course they did Very. Wait, I should actually be wearing gloves with this. There we go. And this is part. I get this. There. There we go. I just had to. So, I guess they just knew that I was going to open this. But, I'm going to put it hopefully around just the garden where the uh, corn is. I'm not going to worry about the whole garden, just where the corn is to protect it. Um, because it is struggling and I need to uh, I need to fix it. So, the best way I'm going to do it is I'm going to put something on. There's a spider. I'm going to put something on uh, like this... Uh, uh, wire and stuff just around uh, the plants and then hopefully put something on top so nothing goes wrong so we're gonna go get scissors or something cut that or dikes to uh cut that off and bring my ginger out with me and probably refill but that's pretty much what we're gonna do today so if i don't have any major disasters nothing should go wrong right everything goes wrong on my farm though Well, I'm back. Probably should have done the switch around. It's going to be in two weeks. I'm going on an adventure. I'm going to bring you guys along as well. I'm pretty excited. I'm pumped and excited for that two-week adventure. It's a, it's a week adventure. Probably like three days of adventure. Maybe even sailing, too. Who knows? All right, let's see. I got to mount the camera, and I'm spilling everywhere. All right, you stay there. Same. You would think that I would, ow, would know exactly how to do this, so I live dangerously. I don't like how they did this. Should be wearing gloves. Yeah. Okay, get 
some gloves. I'm getting gloves so I can live dangerously. So I just finished mowing the grass. I don't know if you guys can see, but I kind of went back and forth and then I kind of went like an angle, like if I was doing tillage. That worked out right. I thought the neighbors left. Why why is there stuff still here? They're still here. Huh. But the car isn't here. Should I be concerned? Let's see. That's not John Deere. That's not John Deere. Where are my John Deere gloves? I can't find my John Deere gloves. I'm going to be blaming leg arms for this. Because, you know, he's a case guy and he likes to pull funny jokes on John Deere people. I'll find it, but I guess for now I'll use some uh -huh. yellow gloves. I'm going all yellow today. Look at that. It's pretty amazing. Now, how am I supposed to... I can still crack my knuckles. I should have checked for bugs. It'll do. Why? There we go. So for now on, I'm, I'm gonna have probably like one. Yeah, I'll, I'll figure it out. Oh, that's my firewood, by the way. Now, what I'm hoping is that we'll try this again the right and smart way without cutting anybody's arms off. In this case, my hands off. Oh, much better. Look at how much faster I can get. Is there still an animal in here? Kids these days. This is something I'm good. Absolutely. Now, while you guys see me struggling, you're probably going to be writing comments and stuff telling me how I should and shouldn't do it. And I think I found a way how I should and shouldn't do it. Come on, lizard, really? You guys can't see it. So I decided to do this the right way and to not mess anything up that is already probably messed up. But I'm going to try and connect these two, which should be 
long enough. I can get my... There we go. Now watch. And then I just go like this. And just smash that down. So that's not bad. I could probably make it longer and go like that. This looks not right. Probably go like that. And that would be like a greenhouse. Yeah, Luca, why did I think about that, huh? Yeah, and that goes well on that. And this will go on top of that. Now, what did you think about that? Okay. So now I got to show you guys this, but I think this should work a lot better and I put a tarp over it. This is amazing. Should have done this in the first place. I really should have. Look at that. See that? That's what you call a genius idea. So much enthusiasm.